Hey what's up YouTube, I'm back again with another tweaks video. In today's video I have 5 new tweaks to share with you guys. That's of course if you are already on the Electra jailbreak. And I'm talking here about the iOS 11.x up to iOS 11.2, also the 11.3.1 up to 11.4 beta 1 up to beta 3. So before I'm gonna be start today's video, I will ask you guys to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new tweaks video. Okay, so let's go ahead right now to talk about the first week that I have for you guys in today's video, which is I will be talking about the color my dog. So first of all, if I want to show you guys how is that going to be, it looks like it's really beautiful if you want to bring any kind of color that you like to bring in your dog with that week right there. So if I want to jump right now under the settings, I'm talking about most of the things here. So let's take a look what we have here. So first thing, go ahead and enable the tweet you can hear this is the magic right there so color my tag there so it's simply just go ahead and top and any one of the color you can pick it up from there so simply go ahead and choose your color from there once you set the color go ahead and just stop on select right there also there is another option here in the bottom if you want to take a look at it the dark color for the current wallpaper if you want to toggle that go ahead you can do that and once you're done from everything you might see right now here you need to tap on the apply all the changes so your device will be take most the effect that you work on it under the settings so this is what the pretty much what the tweak will be provide you with which is i highly recommend you guys to give it a try so yeah guys if you want to take a look at it the tweak called color my dog let me go ahead right now to talking about the second one helios 11 that will be bring a beautiful and nice media control for your lock screen but first of all let me show you guys how is that will be looks like so if you want to take a look right now how is it looks like in your lock screen which is will be bring a nice effect and even nice control and then you can control most of the things from your lock screen even the way of the looking on your lock screen really beautiful now let me go ahead and just jump under the setting to see what we have here so first of all go ahead and enable the tweak and the second thing if you want to enable the background at work you can toggle that from near so this is the way how is that tweak will be work once you install it in your iDevice highly recommend you guys to give it a try because really it's beautiful and it's better than the other media control that I uh, download already on my iDevice so if you want to give it a try Helios 11. The next CD tweak I will be talking about the CC view charge and what is that tweak will be provide you with. So once you plug your iDevice on a charge, once you open your control center, you will be see the charge or your device is uncharged yet. It will notify you once you open your control center. If I want to demonstrate that and showing you guys what I'm talking about right here. So if I want to launch my control center right now, if I want to plug my device and I want to charge my device, you will be see it says your device it's charging so if i want to unplug my device right now you will be see it will notify me and tell me it's not charging so this is the way about the cc view charge once you want to add that tweak into your i device so as I told you guys and as I show you guys about the CC view charge, this is the way about that week once you want to install it in your iDevice. So yeah, if you want to, to download this week in your iDevice, the week called CC view charge. All right, let me go ahead right now to talking about the next one, the windmill. And what is that week will be provide you with? The windmill will be bring the iOS toolbar. So as you might see right now here, this is the almost a lot of things that bar will be uh, provide you once you install that week in your iDevice. If I want to go ahead right now and show you guys how is that bar will be looks like and also there is some customized stuff under the settings which is I'm about to show you guys in a second but first of all let me just talk in here about most of the things so this is the home button here and this is the switcher and even you can make those 
uh, any color you like so you can use the uh, light color the, uh, the black mode color and also you can make it big you can make it smaller the way you like so if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings you might see right now here we have a lot of different things here under the settings so first of all go ahead and enable the tweaking also we have the home gestures you can toggle that and also if you want to use the uh, touch or no force touch you can go ahead and toggle that in my opinion i like to use the micro bar that's why I already toggled that and if you want to hide the switcher button if you want to hidden that or hide the back or you can swap button here so most of the things here you might see you can toggle those so you can hide those you can bring those the way you like if you bring most of the things on the bar and also too many other stuff if you want to go through just make sure once you're done from all those configuration go ahead and just respring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about that week so as i show you guys it's really beautiful and nice a tweak if you want to set that tweak in your iDevice go ahead and give it a try the windmill let me talking about the next one here the minimal s this is a widget which is i use on my lock screen but for this one in order if you want to set this one in your i device you need to have the x and html so once you download the minimal s in your i device go ahead and use the x and html to set that on your lock screen so basically it's a time and i'm about showing you guys right now how is that gonna be looks like it's tiny and small and even even the font looks different it wasn't like the apple stock but i really like it and that's why i want to share this one with you guys so as i told you guys about the minimal s it's really nice a widget if you want to bring that into your i device so that's why i want to share that week with you guys if you want to go ahead and get the minimal s anyway guys this is the most tweaks that i have for you guys in today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i just want to remind you once again don't forget to give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new tweaks video and i catch you with the next one peace